I'm Sherry Brown, Training Coordinator for EBMC, for those of you who don't know me. For those of you who do, I'm sorry. Enough silliness. Okay, then. Let's talk a little bit about where we're at, where we're going, in reference to training for our EBMC Community Association Manager, shall we? One of the things that I know in reference to your position is that there are a myriad of various skills that you need to employ to accomplish your job tasks, managing day-to-day -day operations, attending board meetings, fostering and enhancing positive communication with homeowners and board members, and ensuring homeowner compliance to the CCNRs. Now, these and various other job requirements are considered soft skills, management, communication, and oversight, being able to create solutions to diverse challenges that need resolutions. Those are all considered soft skills. Now, in addition, you need technical skills. What I mean by this is basic computer application skills, the ability to use a computer for budget preparation, project management, task accomplishment. In other words, helping you to accomplish your management skills that you use every day. At EBMC, we use Yardy Voyager. Therefore, you need specific skills to code and approve invoices, create violation and other notification letters, track balances due, and architectural approval issues, plus the ability to maintain a record of communication with your individual homeowners. These are just a few of the tasks that you work at every single day. This is where the training function comes into play. One of the primary issues the training division is focusing on is finding ways to create solutions to provide whatever skill set, training, and specialized tools you need to be able to accomplish your job not just at a satisfactory level, but with excellence. Remember, the EBMC motto is legendary service provided by exceptional people. This is what EBMC is all about. It's who we are. It's where we're coming from. It's the kind of company we are. Given this scenario, one of the things we did in March was upgrade our learning management system to Grace Hill. There are a lot of specific courses on Grace Hill that help build soft skills and have already been assigned to you. We are looking at those particular assignments again, reviewing everything again, and revising as necessary. Regarding technical skill building, we are looking at individual training opportunities for computer application skills like Microsoft Office, Lotus Notes, Internet Operations, just to name a few possibilities. We already have quite a bit of HOA-specific Yardy Voyager content available on Grace Hill. I want you to take a look in my library, external content, and you'll see all of the HOA content from the Yardy University and from EBMC. We are looking to find ways and additional resources to help you do the job you do. It's not easy, and we know this. I hope we can provide you with some of the solutions, some tools, and some of the tricks you need to do your job more effectively and efficiently. Now, between now and the beginning of the year, we will be sitting down 
with a small group of community association managers, and hopefully some of our district managers, to assist me complete a needs analysis of exactly what we need to provide you. We want to make certain we are meeting your training and educational requests specifically for soft skills, technical skills, and software specific skills. The training division wants to expand your training and educational prospects by providing a venue for your community of practice, a place to share answers, ask questions, find resources, and assist each other. As time goes on, all of these will be made available and communicated to you. Our job is to assist make your job easier. We know you don't have a lot of time, so we're going to do the best we can and work with you by providing everything we possibly can. Remember, time is a four-letter word. Have a great meeting. I hope you're enjoying yourselves and taking the opportunity to learn from and share with each other. In the meantime, have a wonderful day. Jay, back to you.